Mom, are you happy? Very happy. Are you happy when I'm here? Oh, that's double happy. About two years ago, Mom started forgetting our birthdays. And she was having more and more trouble answering questions that would have been easy for her before. The doctors believe she has dementia. Mom now remembers faces, but less likely will remember names. What I miss most is the conversation. What I miss most is my mother's outgoing personality. The progression of my mother's disease has made her very quiet. Mom is what some people have called an active observer. If I don't speak to her, she won't talk. Do you remember some of the friends' names? Who's your good friend who's still there? Minnie, do you know the song, Hello, Dolly? Yes. Will you sing with me? Will you help us sing it? Sure. All right. Well, hello, Dolly. Well, hello, Dolly. It's so nice to have you here where you I first belong. learned about music therapy when I saw it on the schedule and decided I'm going to take her. And why? Because I know she loves music. I think Ian is incredibly talented in his ability to connect with the patients here. He clearly knows what to do to bring people out of a shell. From the first day, he really welcomed my mother. My mom responds to the music. I see her pay attention. I see her sing along. I see her answer questions. I see her play musical instruments. She is now way more outgoing. Now I know that dementia is not getting any better, but how she's reacting to it is definitely better since she started music therapy. What about music therapy? When you go there, does it make you feel good? Yes. Do you like it? I love it. My hope for my mother is that she stay happy, she stay positive, she stay free from pain. The hope for myself is that I could be there for her and I could remain strong for her. I just want to tell you that for my whole life, how much you've meant to me, and that I love you so much. The feeling is mutual. I know, even without words, but you tell me all the time. I know. <laughs>